Matthew chapter 24. Well, the first two verses of Matthew 24 describe the disciples with Jesus looking out at the view over Jerusalem and the temple. We can imagine the sun shining on, on the white stone. It would have been a, a wonderful sight. And Jesus came out of the temple and was going on his way when the disciples came to him to show him the buildings of the temple. But he answered and said to them, Do you not see all these things? Truly I say to you, there shall not be left here one stone upon another that shall not be thrown down. The large white stones of that temple seem so permanent like they be there forever, just as the stone and the concrete of our world seems like it'll be there forever. And the Jerusalem temple seemed like that too, just like cities like London, Moscow or New York look like they're going to stand there forever. But that's what happened to the temple. The temple was covered with gold, but when it was surrounded by the Romans, the Jews tried to burn it down rather than surrender it to the Romans. So the gold melted and it flowed down between the stones. The Roman soldiers pulled apart every stone to get the gold that had run between the stones. The words of Jesus came wonderfully true. So we look at what surrounds us. Things seem so permanent, so eternal, so solid. We may save our money, work hard, do extra work because we want to buy that solid stone property in our village or our suburb. Or to buy that solidly built car that will last a long time. That heavy duty jacket that we think will last me a lifetime. But things aren't what they seem, are they? We are to look at life through the eye of faith. We need to have a new kind of vision, the vision of the spirit rather than this natural outlook on the things of life. Nothing here is permanent. Everything will soon fade and break up. One day the face of Jesus will be seen again on this earth. One day the feet of Jesus shall stand again literally upon this planet. And all that seems so solid and permanent will not last forever. All that will last forever is Jesus and our relationship with him. So let's focus upon that and not be deceived into thinking that we can have anything permanent in, in this material.